Hello, Assalamu alaikum students. This is Mathematics D1 in front of you. It is taught from class 6 to onwards in most of the schools of Pakistan. The students from class 6, 7 and 8 and probably 9 students can also take benefit from my lecture. So get ready if you have the copy and pencil nearer to you so you can note down my lecture. And if you have the book available nearer to you, then open chapter 4, exercise 4a and question number three i have already done question number two in my previous video let's read the question carefully first of all before solving the question given that a is equal to three b is equal to minus five and c is equal to six evaluate each of the following expressions in place of this a i shall write three and in place of this three i shall write three and in place of this c i shall write c is equal to six like this and in place of this b i shall write minus 5 students i have placed this bracket because i knew that i have to place the smaller brackets inside that's why i have placed this bigger bracket for my facility since smaller brackets will be solved and the bigger bracket will be turned into smaller ones now 3 6 times will be 18 and smaller bracket has been finished minus minus plus here also smaller brackets has been finished minus minus plus and 5 as it is 3 here 8 plus 5 is equal to 23 and now 3 will be multiplied with 23 3 3 is a 9 and 3 2 is a 6 this is the answer now i'm going to solve part b in place of this a i shall write 3 and in place of b i shall write minus 5 and square in place of a i shall write 3 and in place of c i shall write 6 5 square is 25 minus square is plus positive 25 3 6 times 18 3 25 times 75 minus 18 so we shall get 15 minus 8 7 6 minus 1 5 57 is the answer of this part now let's do part c in place of this b in place of this b i shall write minus 5 and in place of a i shall write 3 in place of c i shall write 6 and in place of b i shall write minus 5 minus 5 over 3 minus minus plus mi minus and minus plus 6 over 5 minus 5 and here minus here 3 will be multiplied by 5 and if it is multiplied by 5 this will also be multiplied by 5 and if they are being multiplied by 5, here 5 will be multiplied by 3. Its numerator will also be multiplied by 3. 5, 5 times 25. And 3, 5 times 15. Here 6, 3 times 18. And 5, 3 times 15. 15 on the bottom of both. So 15 will be written only once. 25 minus 18 will be 7. Minus 7 is the answer. Sign of the bigger value will be used. 25 is bigger then 18 so its sign will be used so 7 over 15 is the answer so let's move to part d now so the part d has been written from exercise 4a now you will see how we shall solve it b plus c over a and a plus c over b in place of this b i shall write minus 5 and in place of c i shall write 6 as it is given in the question and in place of a i shall write 3 in place of a i shall write 3 in place of c i shall write 6 in place of b i shall write minus 5 bigger value is 6 minus plus minus bigger value sign will be used means no sign will be used positive shouldn't be written in the start 6 minus 5 is 1 over 3 minus plus minus 3 and 6 9 over 5 like the previous question we shall multiply the denominator 3 with the 5 and its numerator with the 5 also and here 5 will be multiplied by 3 and its numerator with also 3 1 5 is are 5 3 5 times 15 9 3 times 27 5 3 times 15 15 will be written only once and bigger value is 27 its sign will be used 27 minus 5 is equal to 22 you can do further deviation and thank you for watching whole of my video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you again.